so now i'll create our i'll go concrete and we'll create our beam okay so first of all we'll create our grade beam here i'll just go i'll click that option for beam and after that simply i'll just go here and what will be the size of our beam i'll just consider our beam size will be 10 into 12 okay 10 into 12 our beam size will be 10 into 12 or 10 into 15 inch 10 into 15 inch and here materials what will be the materials i'll select same 3000 psi then apply okay and after that this class the color it's okay and here everything is okay first of all I'll create our beam and after that i'll show you about that of i mean position i'll just move it here i'll also move it here like that now from here that meets point to that meets point i'll create our beam okay sorry i've done a mistake actually i'll just control z again i'll close it i'll click beam and i'll click here our that will be 15 this is our depth and this is our width that will be 10 okay also you can go here by clicking here also you can this is width and this is height clear so after that i'll close it and now everything will be same and same way i'll just click here and i'll click here okay again i'll click here to here and from here to here and from here to here okay so we have created our that beam now suppose you need to move that beam little bit okay i'll just remove that interface i'll also close that on i'll show you about that if i need to move or if i need to up or down our beam then how will do that i'll just close it and i'll just go here windows then view list now i need suppose uh, grid okay, consider that i need grid a okay i'll just click here i'll add it and i'll click okay and i'll click here tilt vertical okay so you can see this is your plan view and this is our elevation view now you can see this beam here we have selected a beam that are below our that grid line i mean zero below zero zero level okay i'll just right click interrupt and i'll select all of that beam by pressing ctrl i'll select them and also i'll select them so i have selected our four beam now i'll again click here and suppose at depth okay so if i need to change the position i'll click here font if i click font and if i click modify just see our beam will go top okay our beam will go top and if i need to take it middle just take it middle and our beam will be in middle so as usual we need that in uh, below our uh, that zero line so i'll con uh, consider that on so this is the way to do it clear now what i'll do actually i'll close it so just see we have created and i can go view list and from here i'll just remove that one and i'll take 3d okay and i'll click okay and from here i'll take tilt vertically just see here here, here is our horizontal line so uh, actually till that lecture it's okay